In this video, we're going to build on what we saw in the previous video, which was how to um, do plots uh, uh, in uh, in R. Now, the plot window that opened up, you can use that to directly save an image, but you can also do that within the, the code and get various um, uh, formats. And in general, you, you simply use a, co uh, a file extension to open um, a file. So, for example, my graph PDF, you put that where you were. Here you'd write um, some code, and then once you're done, you basically close the file with dev.off. Uh, it doesn't have to be a PDF, it can be a PNG um, or, uh, or, or other things. So you can have a JPEG as well, and, and close it and save that as a JPEG, etc. So um, that's the general syntax. Now the Let's see, let, let, let's give this a go. So let's create a PNG and I call the file what I want, but remember I, I have to navigate to it. So I'm going to put it on my desktop and uh, we're going to call it height versus weight plot.png. Um, so that'll open the file. I'm not going to run it yet. And then we do it. So then we plot jjj dollar height dot in dot k g against jjj dollar weight dollar weight height in meters sorry height in meters against weight in k g and then the final bit of code is um, dev dot off so now if we uh, if we run that so we open the file, we plot, and we close it. Null device pops up there telling us that it's worked. But also you might have seen appear just there. That just uh, popped out of nowhere. It wasn't there before. And um, if we open up that, we get our plot as a PNG file. So as I said, you just have to change what kind of format uh, format you want, um, PDF um, or, or anything else. So let's, let's try it with a, a PDF. Now, if I open up the PDF, I get the, the same plot, um, obviously. So that's a nice way of getting stuff out uh, of R. And you can all do that in a code-based way, um, which is obviously uh, nice. Because you can go back and just make a slight change like I just did then.